This video about Dr. Valerie Hunt, her thoughts on human energy field and consciousness. That the human energy field contains the highest level of the human mind was documented in Valerie Hunt's Bioenergy Research Laboratory, HUC LA. Briefly, this is what we discovered. The atomic electrical energy of cells becomes the auric field. The field is both inside and outside of the body, where it colors all sensory information that must pass through the field and skin before it gets to the sensory nerve system. Because the field has a corona on the outside of the body, it is in direct contact with all the energies of the environment, living, mineral and celestial. This is the primary way humans interact with the world. The human field is a dynamic, ever-changing series of patterns of frequencies that oscillate up to 1 million cycles per second, making it the fastest and the most elaborate of the body's electrical systems. Each person has a unique signature pattern of frequencies, his base reference to which he returns when his field is not stimulated. This is a base reference from which his field responds to other fields. The mind field is the highest level of memory containing information about the physical body, thoughts, feeling states and past and present life experiences, particularly if memory is of profound experiences. Emotions connected with higher states of consciousness organize the mind field and make it susceptible to new and threatening situations. This level of emotion is the deepest motivation of behavior. A field which is flexible and strong with a wide range of frequencies is a stable signature, an ideal resting ground which is complex and well organized but not chaotic. This is a comfortable field which gives satisfaction, allows exciting discoveries and makes possible exuberant health. This mind field concept leads us directly to the dynamic continuum of consciousness, which scientists call the stream of consciousness. The stream of conscious awareness is ever shifting. Sometimes awareness is directed to material things, sometimes to mystical and spiritual things, and sometimes to survival. The focus of consciousness may move rapidly through all levels simultaneously. Cognitive memory seems to lag behind when memory areas of the brain are stimulated. But consciousness is instant when the memory stored in the mind field is stimulated. The scientists who have redefined the mind have discovered vibratory frequency patterns that coexist with patterns of consciousness. Here the mind is found to exist in the field 
rather than in the denser tissue of the brain. It exists in organized energy containing information from the soul's experience in this and other livelihoods. The field permeates all tissue and radiates around the body. And meditations with an internal focus on the stream of consciousness is the best way to broaden the narrow consciousness of most people.